Hey, good morning, good morning, fellas and girls. Look at that. We're here at our customer, and uh, we're backed into the door over here. And look at this beautiful sand that they got down here, right? Eh? Nice, nice sand. And we're just going to be dropping our trailer here. And we already lowered our landing gears and all of that. And literally, right across the street from here, basically, literally, just right across there, is where the uh, truck stop is so the guy said inside of here it's gonna take about three three and a half hours to get me loaded which I suspected it's you know with this kind of load I can't really say what kind of load it is but but yeah uh, I know this type of load so it usually takes a good while before they get you loaded because everything is hand loaded so uh, I said well if it's okay I go over there to truck stop and have me breakfast and they said oh yeah no problem Go ahead and do that, and then when you come back, just don't back underneath the trailer, they told me, and you'll be fine. So, uh, I guess we'll go over there to the truck stop and have me some breakfast. All right, guys, it is time for some breakfast. Look at that, guys. Oh, yeah, some good coffee and some breakfast. That's very good. Ladies and gentlemen, yes indeed. The load was already loaded before 10 o'clock. These lazy people over there, they were just taking their sweet ass time with getting the paperwork ready. Took them a full hour just to do the paperwork. Unbelievable. Like you couldn't do the paperwork in the three hours it took you to get loaded? Like unbelievable. But Part of trucking sometimes guys you wait and then you wait and then you wait some more yes indeed we checked in at uh, quarter to seven this morning quarter after 11 we left so we're going to be writing that time down after two hours we get paid for sitting and waiting there so uh okay Guess what? After two hours, I'll be getting paid to be sitting and waiting there, so I ain't gonna complain about that, am I? New no way. Although I am still complaining because I want to get out of here. I don't want to be sitting here. I want to go home. And get miles behind me. I make much more money if I do some miles. That's right. Now we got to hammer down and I guarantee you it's going to be exactly a rush hour by the time I get to St. Louis. It's going to be bad. <laughs> Although, coming into it won't be so bad I think. Shouldn't be anyways because uh, most of the people are going to want to get out of uh, St. Louis, right? So it might be alright but we'll see. I guess only time will tell. We'll make our way that way and find out, I guess. Because I think it's about four hours, maybe close to five, by the time we will be in uh, St. Louis. I mean, I know it was 286 miles from Jackson, Missouri, to this place, and I'll be going back uh, by Jackson there, so, so I may be yeah, that would be about four and a half hours up to Jackson, probably. So probably another hour up there. So it might actually be six o'clock by the time I actually get to uh, to St. Louis. It might not be too bad. We'll see. We might get lucky. That would be nice. That'd be actually very nice. Speed warning. But hey, a beautiful sunny day out here again. Nice and warm too. Well, that's time to put the hammer down and let's go. Are you guys ready to come and roll along with the Trucker Rudy show today? I hope you are. All right, well, we got 65 speed limit. And kick her up in that sure too, and then uh, at least cruise at 62 miles an hour today. That way we get a few more miles behind us. Usually I do it at 60, but 
I think today we'll do 62. Yeah, that extra two miles an hour sometimes helps a lot, you know. stop here a few minutes ago and fuel the truck up because it's a lot cheaper fueling her up over here than it is further north so I said oh, well, I'll fuel her up over here and I think I should be able to make her home from here with the tank of fuel that I got anyways so I don't think I'm going to be fueling anywhere anymore until I get home unless you know by the time I get up there to Iowa it looks like I'll be you know, using a lot of fuel, then I will be fueling up. But other than that, I don't think I will. So, uh, we'll see how it goes. But, yeah, we're only about an hour away from uh, St. Louis, it looks like. So, uh, it's 20 after 5 right now in the afternoon. So, I think by the time we get down to St. Louis, I think we shall not encounter too much of a traffic jam, I would think probably be already dark by the time we get there I wouldn't be surprised or just about so uh, so yeah I think we're gonna go a little bit past st. Louis and then uh, I think we're gonna call her quits for today I wouldn't mind getting into Iowa tonight but that's probably gonna be a late night drive and that'd be hard to find parking anywhere all reality it doesn't really matter I gotta take another two ten hour like tonight and tomorrow night you gotta take a ten hour break you know so uh, there really ain't no point in me driving late it, it ain't gonna get me home tomorrow so may as well just stop earlier and then get going early tomorrow morning and then I can stop early again tomorrow so hey that works for me but yeah I'm surprised it hasn't rained yet. It's kind of cloudy here for the last few hours already, but I thought for sure there for a second it was going to be raining. But it never did. It never did. But yeah, we'll put the hammer down and see how far we make it, right? All right, guys, we are done for today. We have made it to the Flying J just before the Iowa border yes indeed we have so we are all ready to go to bed and and then uh, continue on with our journey tomorrow I know probably today is a little bit of a shorter day but it's because you know we got a late start we only left like at the 11 o'clock because our load wasn't ready before that and all that so Hope you guys don't mind too much. I mean, some of you have been asking for shorter videos. Some of you don't mind the longer videos. Some of you like the longer videos. So, try to please the crowd completely every once in a while, right? Have a bit of a longer video once in a while. Have a shorter video once in a while. So, you guys are all happy. But, uh, hey, the main goal is we can make it interesting. So, you guys get to enjoy the videos and all that stuff. But, uh, hey... We'll see you right here again tomorrow morning. So don't go nowhere. If you haven't uh, given it a big thumbs up, please do so. If you didn't like the video, well, too bad. Then give it a thumbs down. If you really enjoyed the video, share the video. There is a share button there in the bottom. Go ahead and hit that. If you're new to our channel, we would love to have you on board by hitting that subscribe button. With that being said, we appreciate all of you guys, and we'll see you on the next one. It's time to get going. It's time to move on. Put this behind me. That day.
is gonna come. I'm breaking the wall.